Shiraliums! Shiraliums! Watch this epic gamer moment, you guys. It's gonna be such an epic game. Put these on. Take the seat. Do the do the funny. <laughs> do the intro. Do the funny. It's a it's Wheel of Mutt. Brand new season. Episode two. Miles here. We got Bailey Zappi at quarterback. It's a big episode. We took an L in the first one, but we sacrificed the Danny and Tomlinson. You know all this. Do the intro. You got it. Do the funny. Dude, no, you're joking. Yikes. Yeah, one for four. Hey, we got Garrett Bowles. We'll clap. Yo, honestly, that's the bougie Smith shoe. Nice. Great. Oh, I should see. Yes. Really? Let's go. Dude, you can fuck up all of them, but oh! <laughs> you're a fucking savage. Nice job, L. Job, L. Too easy! It's too easy. Go! Go! Go, man! Go! Go! It's a four interception! What are you talking about? Dude, I don't it's think you're not The best players we got. <laughs> yes, sir. We got Rashid Walker. <laughs> we got Jason Kels. Jason Kelsey. Kelsey. Yeah. Pat. Oh. Rear move. Yeah. Christian Watson. Yeah. Nightmare. Yeah. Miles Sanders. Yeah. You know the vibes, boys. About to be W. All right, cool. Now, uh, misogyny joke. I don't have a misogyny joke. Matt is a literal like housewife. Oh. He cooks, he cleans. Bro, he bro, does, bro, 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 He does the dishes. Dude, no way. That's oh. not, it's not true, guys. She's pranking you for uh, for free. I'm not. Hell, stop. Stop. Oh. <laughs> I talked about this. <laughs> you said keep it between us. <laughs> and of course, if you need Madden coins, make sure to go to instantmaddencoins.com. They sell coins on every single platform. You can also directly buy players or training points. Buying limiteds and quick selling them is probably the safest route, so I recommend that. This is a significantly better deal than what EA is gonna offer you, and you can get 10% off when using the code MMG. Just use the link in the top of the description. Well, I'm on. Hey, what's good, boys? It's Christmas season, and I'm doing my best to get you a wheel of mine every single other day in December. And just so we're on the same page, when January hits, bro, I'm not gonna say I'm burning out, because I don't burn out, because I'm built different. But we're posting a lot. I'm starting to go a little crazy. So, January, I'm gonna slow down a little bit, but for December, we're riding the wave, baby! So make sure you show a little love in the comments to all my amazing editors who put up with the ridiculous amount of content that we pump out. Ty, I love you. Spectacular work. Nice cock. Solid vein down the middle. All right, Wheel of Mutt, let's talk. We made a serious sacrifice last episode, taking the L, but getting over 100 rushing yards and throwing for 25 plus with our kicker. It landed us, Miles Sanders, Christian Watson, a couple of offensive line minor upgrades, and some defensive minor upgrades. And only time will tell, as I said last episode, if that was a good call or not. But all I know is I have three wheel spins and I'm 0 and 1. Although if we want to play deja vu, I did lose my first game. And last season, I also lost my first game of the season. So maybe this is a good sign. Our first wheel spin is headed out right now. Let's see. Oh my God. Is that going to hit jackpot? No shot. Oh, it was so close. Dude, that was like a quarter of a spin off. Twitter's going to pick an 89 overall. However, I get to choose what 89s. It's just I, I poll on Twitter to figure out exactly what 89. Kind of tempted to take a quarterback here, except I think I'd rather use a different wheel spin on a quarterback. I don't want to be condemned to only an 89 overall all quarterback, right? I would like a left tackle be really good so that we can get Miles Sanders moving. A tight end would be really good too. Defensively, honestly, my secondary is okay other than Tyson Anderson. Let's get a left tackle. There's only one 89 left tackle and it's Anthony Munoz. However, this is a pole, so I'm gonna have to put another player in there. I'll also put in an 89 overall quarterback. The best 89 quarterback is Jalen Hurts. Are we really gonna run back Jalen Hurts? Like, are we really gonna run back Jalen Hurts? I've already got Kelsey and Miles Sanders, bro. How about this? There's an 89 Joe Burrow. Let's put 89 Joe Burrow in there. I have a feeling they're gonna pick Joe Burrow. And let's do one more 89. You know who's the best 89 in the game? So here's the 89 Joe Burrow. He's actually really good. That's who I assume everyone's gonna pick. But bro, the best 89 in this entire game is Troy Anderson. This is who I hope gets picked. 89 overall 
overall middle linebacker. He gets lurker discounted. He's 91 speed. He's six foot four. So if Twitter knows their mutt cards, Troy Anderson's a pick. I just don't think that a majority of my Twitter following is going to know exactly who's the meta here. And then as far as my team is concerned, I guess 89 Anthony Munoz is also good. The tweet's going to run for five minutes. Let's see how it goes. The poll's about to end. I'm actually shocked. So Joe Burrow is 56%. I'm not shocked by that. 30% said Munoz, and the lowest percentage was Troy Anderson at 14%. The poll's not entirely over, but there are 1,500 votes in, so I'm going to rig the election. I don't see any possible way someone beats out Shiesty. I'm excited to have Joe Burrow. It is going to be really fun, but it wasn't my first choice. I think I think Troy Anderson would have been my first choice. Although we do need a quarterback. I like Bailey Zappi, but I don't actually like Bailey. He's happy. All right, our first wheel spin gets us a nice role player quarterback. I can't say he'll be our end game quarterback, but he's an excellent upgrade for now. Our second wheel spin. Oh my God, these are so good, but it just depends. I'll show you how this works after I mess with this Joe Burrow. I want to do this before I forget. Gambit is one of my favorite abilities. I like run and gun too, but for a quarterback as slow as Burrow, I'm going to do faster passes that can't be picked off by AI defenders. This is way better than you think it would be. Identifier is really nice because I run that all the time. Time. And I guess since I have open slots, I guess I'll give him Homer. Joe Shiesty, baby. All right, Harvest 93 Siri. I'm not actually going to use Siri. I'm going to use Echo. Hey, Echo, put your volume to max. There you go. If you're a sci fi movie fan like me, then I have something for you Avatar, the way of. Hey, Echo! Shut the fuck up! So, the Harvest 93s. We are going to sort these by time remaining. I'm going to have Echo give us a random number, 1 through 50. Now, each of these rows is 6 players. So, the player on the far left is 1. The player on the far right is 6. That would mean that then this Jason Taylor is 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Hey, Echo, pick a number 1 through 50. Here's a number between 1 and 50. It's 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. <laughs> Holy shit. When he said 10, I was like, whoa, that's on my screen right now. Okay, so just so everyone's clear, Darren Waller was 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. He's 93 overall, Nick Chubb. I think Isaiah Simmons is probably the absolute best. Next after him would have been Sir Tan or JC Horn. But overall, I'm actually really excited to use Nick Chubb. Granted, I do have Miles Sanders, but Miles Sanders has all already been relegated to a backup slot now that we have Nick Chubb. Oh my god, I bet you this Nick Chubb is insane. I've never used this card. I I'm gonna be honest with you. I didn't know this card existed. This is a Harvest Limited. He's got two AP evasive, zero AP goal line back. Zero. It's free. Holy shit, it's free. And was that two AP tank and one AP bruiser? Oh my god. He's got 92 speed, 94 excel, 94 break tackle, 93 truck. His change of direction and catch. Little bit to be desired there, but I think he's gonna be incredible. Oh my god. Okay, so freight train, you literally don't even have to think about that. Bruiser for 1 AP is amazing. I can't even get that for 1 AP. Now, this is actually a difficult choice. 2 AP tank is very nice, but here's the thing about tank. If you play a good player, tank isn't very good. Good players do not go to hit stick you when they know you have tank. They go low every time. Goal line back for free is pretty nasty. I'm gonna run that, and if I really want tank, I could put it here for 3 AP. So that would overall be 4 AP for Nick Chubb. I'm actually gonna do it, because I'm not putting that much on Joe Shiesty or anybody else. I don't even have a tight end on this offense. Nick Chubb is kitted out with tank, bruiser, and goal line back. So now it's Nick Chubb and Okoye. That is a beefy backfield, dude. And then Miles Sanders is now backup. Identifier, Nasty Street, Kelsey. Nick Chubb's good. Okoye. Oh, and I have Identifier on two different players right now. And I have AP to spare. Okay. Well, let's take Identifier off of Joe Burrow. I'll keep him with Homer just in case we can activate Gambit. And I'll give Jefferson not just run off a lead, but also route tech. All right. So with our third wheel spin let's make a defensive upgrade i really don't like having rasheed walker or pat fryermuth but that's okay oh i'm gonna get troy anyway blitz 99 90. i'm gonna get troy anderson anyway all right let's go madden 23 players program blitz so there's a 92 chidobi wujie corner that would be really good 92 kyle hamilton strong safety troy anderson is a true linebacker who gets lurker i'm not getting fancy with it oh my god by the way guys there's a crazy good update troy anderson oh no troy anderson's at 89 oh fuck oh that sucks gigantic balls i'm gonna do 92 overall kyle hamilton 
Kyle Hamilton is basically Troy Anderson, but he's a safety. Same speed, a little bit less excel, same height. Oh, I really wanted Troy Anderson. Kyle Hamilton's still an amazing pickup. Here's what we're gonna do, too. I I actually, this kind of works out. So right now, I've got Tyson Anderson at CB3, right? So we're gonna make Kyle Hamilton my CB3. So he will definitely be on the field. At specialist, my sub linebacker, rather than Palomalu, will be Kyle Hamilton. Let me see what other adjustments I can make to him. He gets Crusher for one AP. Oh, that's fucking music to my ears, man. Probably all I'll give him. One AP tip drill will do that too. Kyle Hamilton's probably good enough to have an ability on this team. I'll give him universal coverage. Beautiful. Ooh, does it make more sense to move Kyle Hamilton to free safety and Atwater to... It does. It does. This was stupid. I did this wrong. Kyle Hamilton should be free safety and Atwater should be corner three. Because there was a huge new update. I might have already said this. I don't remember if I did. For the longest time, this game would not let you put free safeties at sub linebacker. Only strong safeties could go at sub linebacker. I don't know when they updated it. It was in the last three weeks. But now free safeties can go at sub linebacker. Something that should have been in the game for forever, but it's EA. So, you know, they're just dicking around over there. So Kyle Hamilton will be free safety other than nickel sets where he's sub linebacker. Way better. Beautiful, gentlemen. Let's go. I'm ready for this first game. Of course, we have the challenge wheel, which clutched up so big for us last game. Let's see what we got here as well. It might be two bronze. I thought it was going to be two bronze touchdowns. I stuttered because this should say two silver touchdowns. I realize bronze players are no longer a thing. If I want to complete my challenge reveal, two silver players must get touchdowns today. I do have Pat Fryermuth as my tight end right now. If I can finesse a way to get Fryermuth a touchdown, I absolutely will. And we can complete our challenge. First things first, Shoopty Gupta. He's got 96 hertz, Sean Taylor and Mike Evans. Sick! In the middle is Bruce Irvin. How do we feel about that? Don't throw something stupid now. That was a nice pass. That was a nice pass. Oh! Oh, man! He threw at my face! <laughs> no! Yes! Bruce Irvin! That's 96 Jalen Hurts! You cannot throw that dog shit pass with 96 Jalen Hurts! What are you doing? Nick Chubb has goal line back. Stronger run blocking within five yards of the end zone. That's this right here. Let's get a stretch, let's meet him, and run his ass over. Eight to zero. Technically, I could have gone down at the one with Bruce Irvin, but like, bro, this guy's team is so good. I, I kind of wanted my points there. If I get another opportunity like that, though, now that we have the... No. Who is this? Oh, yes, it's Darius Slay. Yes, Darius Slay! Keep in mind, if I get another opportunity like that, I'm going to get the touchdown. Our boy, Pat Fryermuth. Or I'll sub somebody in, you know? Irvin, nice. Parsons, nice. Another handoff. Okay. Coming down is Kyle Hamilton. Nice stop. I don't think he does this again. I think he's going to pass here. Play action? Oh, no, he does. Hamilton Crusher! He might just keep going right back to this. Let's blitz Bruce Irvin. Ooh. Jalen Hurts got rocked by Kyle Hamilton. I can't believe he didn't fumble. I really thought he'd fumble that. Same thing like an arp. Ooh, that was kind of glitchy. All right, we got him to make a mistake early. I don't know if he's going to do it again. I'm happy we got our points and the two point. Got to play a little offense still, too. I love that he is on Ed Tutal Jones. He is most likely a user D lineman. I think Flood kind of torches him here. Pretty sure Justin Jefferson's wide open. Damn, that would have been nice if I could have racked that and ran up the field. But all right, good to, good to see. Good to see. All right, the slant from Jefferson will move his user, and Nick Chubb should be wide open. Oh, the shovel pass! That was so sick! And Nick Chubb runs him over! Dude, he fucking whipped it out there! That was so sick! Send him right side, he knew, but we'll cut it up the middle! Look at Nick Chubb. Goal line back is activated, I'm going opposite side. Excellent blocking! Oh, up until right there, the blocking was so good until right there. I think Frymuth is open, wait for it, wait for it. He's coming! Oh, Matt! Why, Matt? Why would you force that? Oh my god, he's gonna pick six it. I wanted my challenge wheel so bad that I throw a bad pass. I'm a dumbass. I'm a dumbass. I'm a dumbass. Wow, that's ballsy, buddy. That's ballsy. Like, especially considering you threw a pick six already. That's a, that's a ballsy play call right there. <laughs> he almost could have coughed that up. Want to see a fucking play? Oh, he threw it right there. I was going to pick it up. <laughs> oh. I can't get there. I'm too fat. Oh! Take your point.
I'm a dumbass. Let's go! Greedy Sauce Gardener. We're running right at him, too. Right at the user. Yes, sir. Yes, sir! I'm chewing this clock. I'm scoring. I'm taking it at half. And I'm running right back at you, too. Same play. Good luck, buddy. Look at that runoff elite from Justin Jefferson. You see how far downfield that corner is? That's runoff elite right there. We are moving the ball. He has to adjust, right? So we go play action. And we hit Nick Chubb. He thinks this is stretch. Watch. Yup. <laughs> yup. Let's get it. Nick Chubb. Burned some great clock. Okoye with an amazing block. Block Friar Muth. Let's see if Justin Jefferson's wide open. If not, I'll throw this ball away. I think he is, though. No, he played inside of that very nicely, but we do have a wide open Jerry Rice. I'm going to call a timeout. We can always just forget about our challenge wheel and go for a Jerry Rice touchdown. I'm on board with that. Ooh, okay, Jerry. Holy shit, Jerry Rice out to the four. I would love to get a Jerry Rice touchdown. It's just going to be so hard. I'm going to try and hit Jerry Rice on the right side of the field. We're shifting the line right. If Jerry Rice can come across and get this, we'll get him an upgrade. Now he sees it. Shit. God, I hate where he is on the field here. Second and goal. Jerry Rice. Got him. Let's go. I can't believe he didn't see that. Two point lead if we get this. I'm going Friar Muth. Whoa, that was a bad ball. 14 to 7 is nice. Five seconds left on the clock. And we get ball at half. So a touchdown moves this to a two-possession game. I'm sky kicking to Zonka. I know I'm a little bitch, but I saw that last kick return and I did not like how it looked. He's got two seconds for a final play here. Dude, I cannot believe he... <laughs> he had a pick six. And he showboated. And he didn't get any points for it. That is like the best thing ever. We're gonna blitz these two. And I'm gonna blitz Irvin. Oh no, I didn't blitz Micah. This is so bad. He actually has a huge... He has so much potential for this. Wait, let him come down with it. Just tackle him. That could have been so bad. I tried to blitz Micah and I actually put him on a light blue. He never would have had that time to throw that. Amazing work by everybody though. And we get ball here. Momentum on our side. We have improved blocking. Just going to go a handoff Nick Chubb. Well, that didn't look like improved blocking to me. In fact, that looked like he blew my shit up. Going to try this play action again. That's not open because Nick Chubb is fully blanketed. Turnover right now does not sound nice. He's an overstorm brave. That leaves Justin Jefferson open. Wait, 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 wait. Go, 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 go. Yes. Woo! Joe Burrow is throwing amazing. Wait, you're just gonna give me it again? He moved Michael over there to try and guard it, but it wasn't really there. I'm gonna send I'm gonna send Nick Chubb out the backfield to the left. Oh, he is in man. Shit. I had X so open, I just panicked. Go cut it up, cut it up. Shit. Ooh, how did you get yards on that? Third and seven. Oh no, I have Cade York. Cade York is my kicker. I have to pick these yards up. Seam? Shit. Nick Chubb! Yes! Inside yes. <laughs> now we're in field goal range. Now I'm chewing clock. I have nothing to gain from trying to pick up a quick touchdown here. I chew the clock. I kick a field goal. I win the ball game. Damn. I, he's, he's still got a sick ass team. That's part of the problem, but we're playing really well with what we've got right now. Oh, I had to cut that up though. I had to cut that up. Dude, bro, how the fuck are you getting these off, dude? He's throwing under pressure so well. I could try and go for another Jerry Rice touchdown here. We're gonna let the game dictate whether I go for another Jerry Rice here. If we pick this up, then we're going for Jerry Rice. If not, we're bringing out the field goal unit. Let's see what it looks like. The edge is there. The block's set up. But the Colts swarmed a little too hard. Coach really wants me to go for this. I respect it, coach. I really do. But I can hit a 35-yard field goal, coach. I think this is read option. Oh, it's not? Halfback? Oh my god! Parsons! Blocking the LBs. Guessing pass. He's got nothing. He literally has nothing. Shit, I was so worried about that. That's the thing, is like, that's 95 overall Irvin, and that's 87 overall Slay. Like, I'm not mad. He's gonna ag me. I'm just glad it took him this long to realize <laughs> that this could have been his game plan the whole time. Micah's, Micah's untouched. Oh, he still got it off. Nice play. No, 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 you're not gonna get it off of that. What the fuck was that? That's what I meant, bro. Like, he can score so quickly. I'm glad I have my two-possession lead, though, and the ball once again. Playing a little passive might have just hurt me there. Now I really gotta go for my touchdown. I can't just... I can technically chew clock and field goal this, but I, I'm not going to. See how Nick Chubb is on this play. Ooh, look at that post route from Jefferson. I think Micah mans up Nick Chubb here, though. So he's gonna be out of position. Oh, he 
we torched him, Christian Watson! <laughs> Down to the two minute warning! Nice reception, Christian Watson. Excellent play thus far. I think this is open here. I just. That guy around the edge is kind of fucking me up. This is man coverage, right? Ooh, just barely made up the middle with Joe Burrow, but not really. He's not using any of his timeouts. He's staying on Micah, so he's got a user, Nick Chubb. Oh, just kidding. <gasps> Bad ball. Bad ball, Matt. Fourth and four, he calls his first time out. Gotta stop a touchdown no matter what here, right? I'm going for it. I ice the game if I get this. I'm gonna send Nick Chubb up the middle. I'm looking for Justin Jefferson. He hasn't guarded this all day. It's fourth and four. Christian Watson got him. End zone, end zone, end zone. I had to think about that. I had to think about that for a second. Let's go. Cause it's two possession. That was the correct decision. 14 to 24. Eel! Christian Watson, the rookie, the new pickup, comes up with a massive reception on fourth and four. <laughs> oh, bazooka heave? Wait a minute, I could have picked that off. What the fuck? Honestly, I was so not locked in right there. That was the opposite of locked in. That was an embarrassing play. Montana Vallejo here. The good news? Sauce corner is so fucking good. He didn't get it because he's out of bounds. That was a hell of a play though. No shot. He just got that. Dude, he's scoring in fucking milliseconds. Dude, my pick six. My pick six saved this entire game for me. Bring Palomalu down. He's going to tight end again. Ooh, Kyle Hamilton. Oh my God, how sick. That was such a horrible decision. He has to score another touchdown now. Dude, I want to see the stats. Hey. I hate you people, man. Hey. He scored in like lightning seconds. His pick six sealed his fate, man. Because I don't know if I could have kept up with him that whole game without that pick six. One and one. I won't call it a rage quit. I didn't have any silver touchdowns, so I couldn't have gotten that. He just tried to get to the dashboard quicker. However, I did get a fat W. And on top of my fat W, I got a touchdown with Mr. Jerry Rice. Which means Jerry Rice get an upgrade. Wide receivers balled out. Justin Jefferson was awesome. Nick Chubb was awesome. Although he's not a wide receiver, but you get my point. Five more touchdowns with Jerry Rice, and he is fully maxed out. He can officially get an X Factor if I want, and his first layer of abilities. All right, gentlemen, that was an awesome episode and a big, much-needed win to lock in some more solid role players and an amazing Nick Chubb, an amazing Kyle Hamilton. Although, I felt it right there in that game. Even Kyle Hamilton and Trey Palomalu, who are great safeties, are actually pretty slow. 91 speed on both of them. Some of these wide receivers have 95 now. It's a little scary, but I'm not ready to replace them or anything. I just, you know, I've got some work to do on this team, no doubt. Sauce Gardner with that crazy almost INT. Uh, Darius Slay kind of got mossed, too. Linebackers could use some work, but hey, Bruce Irvin, pick six. Sealed the game from the start. I'd love a new kicker too. That's, I hate kicking with this guy. Holy shit. But I'm proud of everyone. A big dump today. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Thanks for watching as always. Peace.